All right, welcome back to my uh, channel on YouTube. Today I'm gonna show you what I just got. I got this uh, tile saw from Harbor Freight, and I just opened the box, trying to show you what it's inside the box and uh, how is that saw gonna do for my tile. So let's get started. All right. Here is look like the, uh, the white cover, some tools, some fasteners. Here are the, uh, I think the mitre piece. made of metal comparing to the cheap tile saw that you can get from uh, anywhere else which is cost around like $55 to $60 it's all made of plastic to other brands while this one it's made of steel which is give you a uh, I think a more precise cut plus this guy it's made of aluminum which is uh, which is also great and this is how you take a measurement. This is how you set them up. You've got this guide here. See, that's how you latch it, or that's how you lock it. You just take the measurement that you want. You got from zero to four inches this way and zero to nine inches the other way. Just set them up how much you want to cut and then you just lock it from here and it didn't go anywhere wow that's a lot of wind all right so uh what i'm gonna do today i'm gonna cut some backsplash stone and uh, we'll see how it's gonna act but what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna use a dry cut not a wet cut because i got the peel and stick backsplash or self-adhesive backsplash and uh, um, they don't recommend like to use a wet, wet cut with it so let's see how it's gonna work here you can see where you control degrees that you want to make your cut with so we have from we got 0 15 30 and 45 degree mitre this is the uh, sorry okay if you look at here you can see you got uh, 0 15 30 and 45 degree mitre and you got the uh, on and off switch here this is the guard the first thing that i'm gonna do is to uh, install the guard here or maybe before that i need to install the blade because it's not coming with a cutting blade so let me check all right here to, uh, to put the new blade in there is like two screws here you can see it two of them here you have to take them off Here is my blade, the one that I'm going to use, it's a, a Dewalt blade, high speed or high performance. And, all right, look at they already marked it on the, on the cover and you got a mark here, so I just work like that. Put this 
Schauen wir mal. comes with two uh, wrenches, one to hold the, uh, the screw and the other one to tie them up. And this is the, uh, the water reservoir. All right, once the blade is set, we just put this piece back on the back side, just like that. And then to put this cover back on, just like this. Just align it, put the screws back on. on the side for your mitre, just like what he said. One more thing, they, I just found this bag, it does have some uh, like vibration absorbers maybe. These goes bottom of the leg, like they act like leg. For it. So you just add them here, bottom. Ready to go now. So let's try it. Alright, always remember to wear your protective gears, some glove, some mask, hair protection, a goggle, because this may chatter like that. So make sure to lock your mitre. Okay. And how much we're gonna take now? We'll take about like one inch. Okay, so I'm gonna set them up on one inch, both sides. Lock it. It should be okay now. All right. <laughs> of the tool.
Well, here is the cut. It's look decent. I don't know. I do like it. But uh, I think it would be better like if I use a wet cut with it. So, that is it. It worth $60, $65, $70. It's, uh, I think it's worth every dime that I spent.